I'm not going to give someone's sensitivity the time of day most of the time, right? Look, if someone's parents just died, I'm not about to make a your mom joke. But, um, you know, if someone, if someone gets into a car crash, uh, even if that's like a big, big thing, like their car is totaled, right? They lost like $20,000 worth of car. I'm going to make a joke about them being a bad driver or something like that, you know? Um, so I have a line for myself, but the line is not where, you know, Western society would want it to be. It's much, much, much deeper. Um, almost any joke is okay for me. But, you know, I do have a line. I'm not like, people think I'm autistic and it's, I'm not autistic. I, I, people think I'm on the spectrum. They don't think I'm autistic. They think I'm on the spectrum. I actually have the opposite issue. I'm not on the spectrum at all. Like, okay, people with autism, like there's different kinds of autism, but when people talk about autism, they're usually talking about people having weak cognitive empathy, but normal effective empathy, or at least, you know, maybe even higher effective empathy. But I have normal cognitive empathy, but very low effective empathy. And because of that, I do have some sociopathic tendencies. Um, and it's not, uh, I don't click with people quickly. I don't um, care that much about first impressions. Um, I don't get close to people very often, even after meeting them for the 20th time, they'll go in for a hug and I'll, I'll like, you know, just go just be like, yeah, fist bump or whatever, you know, it's going to take 50 or a hundred times meeting up, you know, um, I don't like to be connected with people so quickly. So I, I don't like to give, you know, I'm already way past Dunbar's number. So, but I can understand their emotions. I understand where they're coming from. And when I'm meticulous about it, I can be really, really calculated and I can appear however the hell I want. I can appear like a, like a wolf in sheep's clothing. I can be really manipulative if I wanted to. Um, whenever I used to like, act around people, everyone would tell me like, oh, I have very high emotional intelligence. Like I can fake it if I try. But the thing is, I'm done trying. I'm done faking it. Um, if you experience a victory and you're celebrating, I'll know how to react. But chances are, I won't feel anything. I won't feel happy for you. I won't cheer with you because I don't share that victory with you. Same thing if you experience a great loss or any other kind of emotion. I'm aware on how I should act. Um, I'm very aware. In fact, people like people will literally point out like, oh, dude, you're the most emotionally intelligent person I know. Just because I'm really, really aware on how I should act. But I don't feel enough of that emotion to elicit me to act in that way. So it's not that I'm autistic where I can't judge these things. I have the opposite problem. I... I have a, I have some sociopathic tendencies. You could say psychopathic tendencies. I'm not a total psychopath. Um, that would, I mean, if I was a total psychopath, I wouldn't be doing any of this shit that I'm doing. But, um, but I mean, maybe I gotta, you know, talk to somebody about it because people are not the best judges of character of themselves. And I'm like me judging myself is the purest form of bias. So yeah, maybe it's not up, for, up to me to judge myself. I could, I'll definitely say people things about myself that most people would consider to be negatives, right? Like, um, you know, sociopathic tendencies. I'll say that because I don't think anybody will have a problem with me shitting on myself, basically. But, um, and yeah, you know what? I will gas myself up whenever I feel like it. Like, I'm, I'm a fucking god-tier creative video editor and things like that. When I want to be. I don't edit any of these clips or any of my streams or anything like that. But um, when I wanna be, like for my music videos and shit like that, I'm literally better than some of the best music video creators in the world, but nowhere near their level of fame yet.